Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. My name is Melanie and this video is part three of my organization series. I will be tackling my bathroom linen closet and also I decided to go ahead and do underneath the bathroom sink. In the middle of filming this, I realized that I forgot to record a before shot on my camera so I ended up having to put this clip in from my phone. I hope you guys are not too upset with me. So I'm gonna go ahead and clear out everything from the closet and also from the cabinet. I'm gonna sit it in the hallway. And then later I'm gonna go through and sort everything, throw away which trash, and I'm gonna try to organize it to how I'm gonna place it back into the closet. Now I gotta be totally honest with y'all. When I was planning this video, I saw it going a certain way in my head. And once I cleared everything out of the closet and I realized how much stuff I actually had, I just, I got so overwhelmed. Like I just, the video <laughs> filming this did not go according to plan. And you'll see why, because it was very limited space. I had to keep opening up the door, closing the door. It was just setting the camera up was weird. So yeah, I hope you guys just like how everything came together. So I'm just going to use a Clorox wipe to wipe out the closet and the cabinet and I'm also going to sweep up the bottom of the closet and wipe that out as well. I know you all can see that my closet is very small and that I'm working with limited space so I'm going to try my best to make it work. Dear Lord, please do not ever, ever let me put this much stuff in so little space ever again. In Jesus' name, amen. So I went ahead and I placed the storage bins in the closet how I liked it. And what you see here is just me putting all the things that I sorted through back into the closet. And um, yeah, I did some of it off camera. So if it looks like I did more, I did it off camera. So I bought some chalkboard labels from Hobby Lobby and I'm gonna put them on these clear bins here. In these bins, I have my skin products, toothpaste and like medicine and stuff. I love fresh towels and washcloths. I get it from my great grandmother. When you go into her house, she's guaranteed to have milk, eggs, bread, and fresh towels and washcloths. She used to be a housekeeper, so I think I learned all my skills from her. Shout out to Nana.
Okay, I'm just gonna do a quick run through of how I have things set up in here. This is the finished product. Um, I decided to throw this artificial plant in here just for aesthetics. Um, I have in this in this bin I have some of my hair products. Um, I have a lot of hair products. They're, they're all over the place. And over here is more hair products. These are more like my hair tools, blow dryer, curling irons, and stuff like that. In this basket right here, I have rollers. I told y'all I had a lot of hair stuff. This one I left empty. So I can put maybe some miscellaneous stuff in here. And on this third shelf right here, I have skincare. Um, this is oral hygiene stuff, toothpaste. I have to get more um, floss sticks, but one to the next bin here. This is all all of our meds, um, vitamins and stuff like that. Um, and on to this row, I have towels. I did have a mixture of gray and um, white towels, but the gray ones were getting old, so I decided to toss them. And over here in this bin, I have our washcloths. Um, I got them, tried, I, I tried to like, color coordinate them um mainly the kids use these color rags right here and i try to use either the light color ones or especially for my face i'll use the white oh, um the white cloths for my face but this is how i have it set up i wish we all could use i wish they all were the same color but we'll all get them mixed up and it's not really that deep now here to the bottom part of the closet i have extra rolls of toilet paper and my cleaning supplies. And this right here is called a weasel. Let me tell you, if you have any clogged hair on your drain, this will absolutely get it. Dior's trying to hush up Roman while I record this quick voiceover. But, um, so onto underneath the sink, right here, I have, you guessed it, more hair products. All of my brushes, combs, if you don't know, doing here is like a hobby of mine so um on to the next in the back i have like little i don't want to say this is miscellaneous i got like peroxide um contact solution an extra hand soap coconut oil sunscreen and um bug spray from for um when we go out and our toothbrushes and cups for mouthwash which reminds me i need to go get mouthwash and under here it's just my husband shaving stuff and all his barber tools yeah so that's it and i hope you guys like how i did everything well i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up if you're new to my channel i would love for you to hit that subscribe button so you can check out all my videos and you know we can become like this little best friend type we ain't never met each other type you know what i'm trying to say so go ahead and subscribe to my channel make sure that you hit the notification bell so you won't miss a video and if you are returning welcome back and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.